Meanwhile, public health officials have announced a major H1N1 vaccination clinic. Yeah, they're specifically targeting those most at risk for health complications. News 3's Mark Lovacott joins us with what you need to know tonight, Mark. Yeah, guys, there will be two clinics that people need to know about next week, but each targeting a different group of people. And if that's not you or your child, you're being asked not to come. Good job. That wasn't so bad, was it? There will be many tears shed next week, but for very good reason. We will be uh, giving approximately 5,000 vaccines each day. Armed with a total of 10,000 shot and nasal vaccines, Madison and Dane County Public Health will attempt one of the largest mass flu vaccinations they've ever done. These, these are, are the groups uh, that are at highest risk, but we are especially hoping to uh, serve uh, those people in Dane County who are uninsured. Both clinics will be held at the Align Energy Center. On Tuesday from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m., public health will be targeting pregnant women, children 6 months to 23 months old, and children 5 to 18 years old with underlying health conditions. On Wednesday from 11 a.m. to 7 p.m., the clinic will be for children 24 to 59 months or 2 to 4 years old, people who live with children under 6 months old, and child care providers who care for children under 6 months old. The gates will open a half hour before the clinic starts. There will be no camping out overnight or lining up. Uh, the gates will open half hour before they start. These clinics are the first since public health stopped the school-based clinics because of lack of vaccine supply. Looking back and knowing what they know now, public health leaders say those clinics, which did not target those most at risk, were probably a mistake. If I had known there would be a scarcity of vaccine, yes. Uh, but I didn't know that. Um, some people have suggested they saw it coming all along, but... I guess they're smarter than I was, and they didn't talk to me. A lot of information we threw out there. If you missed it or if you want more information, you can check out the link section on channel3000.com for everything you need to know. And if you are not part of this targeted group, Public Health says there will be more H1N1 clinics down the road, depending on vaccine, and they hope to eventually restart the school-based clinics mm -hmm. that we talked about a couple months ago as well. Right, and we'll let you know yep. as soon as that happens. Mark Lovacott reporting. Thanks, Mark. You bet.